Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this circle as you can see in this diagram such that these two chords A, B and C, D are parallel to each other and moreover this angle A is 140 degrees and now we are going to calculate this angle X. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Before we proceed any further, let me make it clear that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started and here's the very first thing we are going to do. We know this straight angle from here to here. This is 180 degrees. So therefore, this angle has got to be 180 minus 140. That is going to be 40 degrees and now let's recall alternate interior angles theorem according to this theorem angles formed on the opposite side of a transversal when a transversal intersects two parallel lines in our case a b and c d are parallel lines and this a d is our transversal therefore these two angles this angle and this angle they are going to be our alternate interior angles and these angles are always equal so if this is 40 degrees this angle has got to be 40 degrees as well now let's recall a cyclic quadrilateral a quadrilateral which has all its uh, four vertices lying on a circle and in our case uh, these vertices a p C and D are on the circle. So therefore this APCD is our cyclic quadrilateral and moreover the opposite angles in a cyclic quadrilateral add up to 180 degrees. In other words the sum of these two opposite angles are going to be equal to 180 degrees so let me go ahead and write down these two angles i can write uh, angle x plus uh, 40 degrees they add up to 180 degrees let's subtract 40 degrees from uh, both uh, sides this cancels out so therefore our angle x turns out to be 140 degrees so thus our angle x turns out to be 140 degrees and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye